Welcome back to uh, Cardinal Spear for the Free Space Port here on Paladin Gaming. We're going into the sixth mission of the campaign. All GTA craft within the Cardinal fleet are ordered to jump into the Vega system. Once within Vega, set course to the rendezvous point. All personnel are to man their stations. Those not on duty are to report to their quarters immediately. Well, our station's in the cockpit of a fighter. To all personnel. The GDD Agamemnon subspace drives were sabotaged just prior to jump. The hell? We have discovered that the explosive device was planted during our resupply of the GDI Rio Grande. Clearly, the objective of this detonation was to destroy the Agamemnon subspace drive so that the Agamemnon would not be able to arrive in the Vega system and would possibly be destroyed. Fortunately, the detonation of the explosive was delayed, and our subspace corridor remained stable. However, the Agamemnon lost all navigational control and was attracted by the gravitational pull of Vega 7, a gas giant planet on the fringe of the Vega system. Our engines and subspace drive assemblies have sustained heavy damage, but repairs are currently underway. Oh boy. Unfortunately, we have also lost contact with the rest of the Cardinal fleet due to our proximity to Vega 7, whose gravitational field is disrupting our long-range transmissions. Send the fighter? We cannot call for reinforcements or request updates on the status of the task force. However, the Agamemnon will launch recognizance wings to deploy a sensor and navigation buoy system around Vega 7, which can be altered to carry and receive signals from the other vessels within the fleet. A buoy system? You are to report to the briefing room immediately. Your wings should be ready for launch at any moment, in case of possible Vasudan attacks. Alright, so, from that last line I assume we're on... we're the, uh... We're the scramble. We're the scramble squadron rather than the recon wings. Let's uh, let's get to briefing. Pilot attend. The sensor network around Vega Seven has nearly been completed. Unfortunately, it appears that a small of a student task force of three A10 class cruisers has detected this network of buoys and is following the transmissions from the buoys to their source, the GTD Agamemnon. Eh, we can take three Ottens, they suck. Within the shadows is the mission. The Agamemnon is recalling all of its reconnaissance wings. However, it appears that the Vasudan Task Force will reach our position before any of our reconnaissance patrols. The Epsilon Wing of Angel Scout Fighters is defending the Agamemnon at present. Alpha Wing of Apollo Space Superiority Fighters will be launched to assist Epsilon in the Agamemnon's defense. It's not like Otten's carry fighters, just send some bombers and clean them up. Our repair crews recently discovered that our fighter bays were damaged from the jump. We will barely be able to launch a handful of reinforcement craft, if any. Do not expect the Agamemnon to be able to launch enough craft to suitably counteract the possibility of a student reinforcements. Then how do we launch the recon wings and us? The Vasudan Task Force is moving closer to the Agamemnon's position with every moment. Make haste to the flight deck. Alright, destroy all Vasudans, and again it's a scramble mission. Cardinal Spear really hates you picking your loadout, let's commit. Alpha, the Vasudan Task Force's ETA is 30 seconds. We are mustering all of the fighters available for launch and recalling our patrols. But until then, you and Epsilon are all we have. Oh wow, I have one wingman. It looks like Jupiter. In fact, it is Jupiter. It's the great red spot. Agamemnon, the student task force is jumping in. Engaging now. Enemy wing just arrived! No bombers, so let's, uh... MX-50s and ML-16s. Agamemnon beat on those guys. 
engage defensive. Good kill. Oh wow, the cruisers are right on top of us. Destroyer has jumped in. It's the Atar. Oh damn. Alpha, the Atar is launching fighters and bombers to engage us. Defend the Agamemnon at all costs. Support ship being deployed. New bandits in the area! Agamemnon, at this rate, we'll never make it. Even with two cruisers left, we're getting pounded, and bombers are inbound. Alpha, as soon as those bombers are in range, you are to destroy them. We are launching beta on your Gorgon class bombers. ETA. Rearming complete, sir. Beta wing has arrived, awaiting orders. All the Sudan cruisers have been destroyed. Alpha. To conserve our resources, we are recalling Beta Wing. You are to eliminate all remaining Vasudan craft. They just got here! That is a lot of Vasudan craft. Destroyer. Your successful defense of the <coughs> Agamemnon is to be commended. The entire crew thanks you for your skillful effort. It is clear that the Vasudans know of our status and position. 
Fortunately, we have managed to repair our primary drive systems, and so the Agamemnon is now en route towards the rendezvous point of the fleet. We still have no word from any of the other vessels within the Cardinal fleet, and we are recalling our reconnaissance patrols to lower our chance of detection from the Sudan forces in this system. Report to the briefing room immediately. If the situation changes, we will need all available pilots to be ready for launch as soon as possible. Dismissed. Yes, sir. So, no recommendations. Nine total kills and two assists. Three Anubis fighters, two Sath fighters, and four Osiris bombers. So, all time total for this. I'll bring our all time total for the second half of the campaign to 12 with three assists. So, this was Within the Shadows, the sixth mission of Cardinal Spear, the Cardinal Spear campaign for the Free Space Port here on Paladin Gaming. This is Paladin Gaming, signing off.